25 pound weighted vest. <sighs> 20 minutes of hit done. This is how you do it when you're a mommy. Baby in the walker watching his favorite show. Getting shit done. And it's like eight o'clock and my hit's done. And now I just have chest and back. And then packing, because I'm going to Idaho tomorrow. Woo! So, I'm in my breakfast this morning, and I thought, you know, I'm gonna try something a little different and do a protein pancake. <clears throat> Not, I have a protein pancake like every day. Sometimes, I literally will sometimes have one three times a day. So, today I'm gonna try something new though. I'm gonna have a coconut, coconut um, protein pancake. And so I was looking at the macros on this, uh, giant bag of coconut flour we got at Costco, amazing. Two grams of fat, which isn't horrible at all, um, and 11 grams of carbs for two tablespoons, which is really pretty good, but then I see this has got um, eight grams of fiber, which is really awesome. And then four grams of protein, so it's not bad. And then I'm adding vanilla, coconut extract, and then some baking powder to um, make it nice and fluffy. And again, I don't ever measure these, I just guess. And then I'm going to blend it up with 250 grams of egg whites, and I got my pan heating up, and it's really an art. It's quite the art, the protein pancake. Can you say it again? Hang on. Sebastian, up. Good job. Up. <laughs> Yay, Good say it job. again, up. Big boy, so big. So I'm getting ready to make myself a little chef salad here. I've got some chicken, some uncured Canadian bacon, and a hard boiled egg. And I am feeling like having something carbolicious, but I'm going to deny myself that. And I am making zoodles. So if you have one of these, these are amazing. I think you can get them on Amazon and like at Bed Bath & Beyond, places like that. Zucchini. And now we have zoodles. And they come out amazing. You can heat them up and use them with like a marinara sauce if you're feeling like having spaghetti, anything like that. And you've got veggie noodles. Is zoodles a real word? Yeah, totally is. Mm. Looks good, huh? Yep, I just had some. Yeah. Oh boy, look what Amazon brought for me. I think I'm gonna be all set on Tupperware for quite a while. So all I did, I just typed in um, disposable Tupperware on Amazon and that's this is what I got. These are great. They are like the perfect shape to help you to meal prep. Here, I'll kind of give you an idea here of the setup. They're good. The only bad thing about them is that the uh, tops are kind of a pain in the ass to try and get off and on. They're supposedly supposed to be spill proof though, BPA free, all that good stuff. So I think it's like $12.95 for 10 of them. So I got 20 because I just was making, I want to make sure I'm like super prepared. And then I got two things, uh, two giant things of PB2. So excited about this because I am just like a nut whore. God, that sounds awful, but it's the truth. So I am going to be using this in a lot of like my shakes and stuff. I'm really excited. So since I'm leaving tomorrow for Idaho for eight days and this guy is gonna miss me a lot and the baby a lot, we're going on a date night. Um, so we decided to go to a movie. Hmm, weird, we always go to the movie, excuse me. I'm burping because we are having some of this. There's no Shakeology in it. It is just um, bulletproof coffee. It's amazing. I'm not going to have very much because I don't have a lot of fat left in my macros for today. But it is um, coffee blended with grass-fed butter. We get the Kerrygold brand. You can find it at like Walmart. Kerrygold butter and um, coconut oil. Blend it up in the blender with your, with your coffee. So and it's so hot good. outside so you put it on ice yeah it's it's hot in alabama right now so put it on ice and i just ate a bunch of chicken before we left because i knew i was gonna get hungry and i am not gonna have junior mints today <laughs> not gonna do it try not to do it 
hope I won't do it. There's no way you're doing it. I won't let her. Yeah, he won't let me. <laughs> and yeah, almost unpacking. Only, only a little bit of anxiety felt today over like how much stuff I have to do and how little time I have and how I'm leaving tomorrow and flying across the country with a baby by myself. You know, just the usual super mom status. Just got out of the movie and oh. now... Uh, She's walking the wrong way to the car. Yeah, so are you. You were no, following I me. I did on purpose to tell you on the video. You are a liar. Nope. I didn't too know short where. to see over the car. Oh, yeah. Yeah, well, that's true. Now I'm starving. And I'm going to go home and eat some chicken because that's all I can eat for the rest of the day, pretty much. Yay, me. Winning. Breakfast this morning is, oddly enough, protein pancake. Hmm. Thought I'd try something new today, you know? Break out of my box. Hey dude, be happy. I'm gonna feed you in the privacy of this nice nursing room. Thank you, Birmingham Airport. Yeah, VIPs, look at us. We look so handsome. So, we are in Las Vegas. Three and a half hours later, Bubba was on my boob the whole time. So I'm gonna go over some things like being a mom and traveling by yourself. Some things that are really important to take is one of these small little collapsible strollers. You have to have this because you've got to get the baby off your lap at some point. Some snacks for him. So I have the snap peas. We get giant bags of these at Costco. I've got a bag of chocolate protein powder, which I'm having right now. I brought some stevia with me for my coffees in the morning. This is for Sebastian and some fruit leather. I brought a pouch. He likes to eat this kefir, flaxseed, chia, apricot, mango, amazing combo. So I brought one of his um, reusable pouches with that. I had tuna salad in here. I already ate it. Then I froze some pre-cooked chicken. So this is keeping all the rest of the food nice and cool, plus I'll be able to eat it tomorrow and, and tonight. And then I have a bunch of crunch beans and some bell peppers for snacks for me, another pouch for Bash, and then what else? another bag of chicken and a hard-boiled egg. And that's what I got. All right, so we made it to Idaho. We are here in Lewiston getting ready for the wedding and doing all the fun wedding stuff. Earlier today, we went and did a little grocery shopping, so I wanted to show you guys some things you can get when you really don't have anywhere you can do any meal prep at all, just some things that you can have on hand to help keep you on track with your bikini prep. So what I got was some instant oatmeal that's organic. I'm gonna put protein powder in this and have this in the mornings or if I need a snack. We also got a rotisserie chicken. I've already taken my rotisserie chicken and took all the skin off and put it into little baggies. And so I'll have this ready to go when I need a snack. We bought a big veggie tray so that everything was already all cut up and I put those into bags. I still have my um, some of my chicken breasts that I brought from home here. Um, and this is just still doing just fine, great to have. So we've got veggies, we've got broccoli, we got cauliflower, carrots, and then we also um, got some packets of tuna so we can just take a fork and eat the tuna right out of the bag there. So that's what we have going for snacks and obviously lots of water, um, Shakeology, and um, uh, some mixed nuts and some almonds as well. So that, that's gonna help me to stay on track a little bit better going out tonight and I don't get a drink and it is unfortunate but I just have to keep remembering why I'm doing what I'm doing and um, remembering the end goal. So it's gonna be a lot of fun, I'm excited. Just 
right, it's breakfast time. We're at the hotel. Sebastian is watching his show. And I got an um, Swiss mushroom egg white omelet with very light cheese, added Canadian bacon. I'll probably have half of these hash browns and maybe save the rest for later. And then I got this spelt grain um, bread that they make here in house because they didn't have any gluten free. We've got a little bit of fruit, some black coffee. Definitely gonna have some Tabasco. Ooh. Sarah's got a nice giant scramble. They treat us really well. Oh, and we did our workout this morning. So productive. <laughs> so productive. Tell yourself in your head if you have to start there. Start writing down positive affirmations every morning about how. Maybe even subscribe to so hard and you're looking for the red and you're looking for the red and you're looking for the red But really all you needed to see is, um, The success principles. I'm sorry. This is I did not plan the breathe round For the perfect thing and we're looking for all the red when the yellow is right in front of your face If there is something in your life that you're just searching and searching and searching for the solution 